Most of you, I'm sure, remember when Arnold Schwarzenegger took to video to say the very appalling thing, screw your freedom. This was something that happened towards the beginning of the pandemic. And since then, because of everything that is not going in his favor recently, because things are going very bad for Arnold Schwarzenegger, we're going to get into all of that in this video today, but things are not going very good for him. And so he decided to get desperate today and offer a very sincere apology for what he said those years ago when he said screw your freedom so if you guys haven't seen the original video where he said that here you go and the only way we prevent it is, is to get vaccinated to wear masks to do social distancing washing your hands all the time and not just to think about well my freedom is being kind of disturbed here no screw your freedom and there you go there you have it. This was when uh, Arnold Schwarzenegger, I believe, was talking with people from CNN or something. It's it's absolutely ridiculous. It's insane. But since then, Arnold Schwarzenegger, because of the a massive amount of panic that he is in, decided to apologize for what he said. So let's see what Arnold Schwarzenegger has to say in this uh, rather pathetic apology. Arnold Schwarzenegger issues half-hearted apology for telling Americans, screw your freedom, in support of all of the... Uh, government lockdowns, restrictions, everything else, the, the tyranny. I should have communicated better. So, uh, two years after autocratically condemning those who refused to basically go along with the restrictions, Arnold Schwarzenegger then said, screw your freedom. And, uh, since then, he decided that he was going to launch a podcast. So it all started from this tweet here. I am loving Schwarzenegger's new podcast. It's three days old, but quickly becoming the most positive corner of the internet on health, fitness, and wellness. There's something motivating about hearing from Arnie every day. Time for the gym. And then Daniel said here in the comments, uh, I want to check this out, but I have a hard time getting over Arnold F your freedom Schwarzenegger, which is a valid response i think i think that's probably the response that a lot of us would have then shane responded and said i wasn't a fan of that stance either but like family members who went there and friends i understand it they were afraid and believed they could trust the authorities who claimed they had their best interests at heart which i don't understand why anybody would want to trust you know the the government i mean come on <laughs> But, uh, but anyway, so Arnold Schwarzenegger responded and said, I want to thank you for your open-mindedness. I think we should be able to disagree without being enemies. Here's what else I'll say. I'm sorry for saying those words. I try to be relentlessly positive, but sometimes my mouth gets the better of me. I should have communicated better. The thing that I want to point out here about this apology, okay, because it's not an apology. He isn't actually apologizing, at least for what the actual issue is. He is basically apologizing here for the way that he said what he said. He's apologizing for how he said it. He isn't apologizing for what he said. It's the fact that he literally said, screw your freedoms. That's what he told the American people, okay? I mean, if that isn't, an al isn't alarming, I don't know what is. This should be something that everyone should have a problem with. So basically, Arnold Schwarzenegger is now facing a massive amount of backlash for what he said here. Sounds like Arnie is using is suggesting removing freedoms was correct, but the language he used to communicate it was the problem. Not good enough. That's exactly what I just said, right? So, no forgiveness. People listen to people like you, and you created hate between family, friends, and neighbors. Let me know what you think about this in the comments below. Do you really feel his apology, or do you think that it's... It's all just a bunch of gobbledygook. So hope you guys enjoyed and I'll talk to you all in another video very soon.